Hello fellow travelers, welcome to No Man's Sky. This is Alon Paul. We are doing the Anomaly-ish uh, mission, the Anomaly Nexus mission for March 8th, 2024. Even though we're in the middle of an expedition, we are going to continue doing Anomaly missions every weekend. So hopefully, as usual, on a Friday night, you will receive this mission. And we'll see how I go through it. Now, I don't claim to be the best player in No Man's Sky by any means, so I will make mistakes on occasion, but I really appreciate all you all's comments in the uh, comment section, of course, uh, of the video, when you all get back to me and say, hey, you could have done this, hey, you could have done that. That is good information, not just for me, but for anybody else who likes to watch the videos and wants to do the anomaly mission later for themselves. They can pick up on some information when you do stuff like that. So we really, really appreciate the comment sections. Thank you. Thank you very much. Uh, in other news, before we get started, there will be a live stream tomorrow sometime just after 4 p.m. Eastern time in the United States. Um, that'll be around, I guess, 4.15 is when I usually try to start that. We're going to be doing speed runs of the Omega mission. And uh, I swear I'm going to get below one hour this time. So, you know, I'm not going to say wish me luck because I don't believe in luck, but hey, you know, stop by and say hi and uh, cheer me on, I guess, is the way I look at it. So hopefully we can get something done. I'm sure that Jason's already pulled a 48 or 45 or, you know, 43, something in the underneath a half hour, but we'll see what happens. All right. And the Nexus mission today is Untamed Pallets. we got to tame wild creatures. We're going to get 1,800 Quicksilver. And for me, I'm going to get 11 life support gels. Like, I really need them. But hey, it's still cool. Let's go ahead and get it done. We're going to initialize the mission. And let's get this taken care of. All right. We're going to still use the Star Runner. I really like this ship a lot. It's a really cool ship. It is the ship of the Omega update. So we'll continue to use this ship. Off we go. And as usual, it will take us there without using any of our warp cells. So that's nice. Hope this video is finding you all doing well today. But again, tomorrow, that is the March 9th. March 9th, Saturday afternoon, 4 15 p.m. Eastern Time live stream. We're going to do at least two speed runs, possibly three. Just depends how things going. And we're going to try to make sure we get it done right. So we may have to restart a couple times. Oh, there apparently is a planet over there. Let's scan this moon and see what it is. Cabled moon? What? That can't be right. Cabled Moon only has one type of creature on it. Let's take a look. It usually is anomalous creature, so there's only one, maybe two, but usually only just one. I can't even imagine this is the right planet. I've been known to have, have kind of a glitch out in regards to it. That's apparently an anomalous animal. And just to get a rough idea, let's take a look. Yep, that's the only one on the planet. Um, so, yeah, fauna dense. And you have to do it with creature pellets. Well, guess what? I don't think these guys take creature pellets. Let's check something out. I'm, I'm curious. We're going to do this. So here's our anomalous creature, right? What are we feeding it? Apparently creature pellets do work. But we have to get 43 more. And you know what I'm not going to do? I'm not going to sit around looking for these balls rolling around on the planet. Not happening. Let's go back to our ship and go find ourselves another planet nearby, shall we? That's weird. Let me know in the comments section, folks. Is this the same planet you ended up on? Very, very curious. So we had a planet nearby. Let's go check out that planet. Apparently it doesn't want me to do so because I'm on a moon. Alright, first of all, let's scan it. Poisonous planet, fungal mold. Guess what? I bet you this has a lot of animals on it. Let's do it. What do you say? Not cool. Green paw prints. It's a ball. <laughs> There's no paws on that ball. Be pretty cool if I had a whole bunch of paws around the outside. I think I would like that. I don't know about you.
So as you can see, I've moved to a different planet. Now, um, I shouldn't have to. It, it should still count, okay? Just to be clear. We're just going to give it a couple moments for the animals to start popping into place. Anything flying around isn't going to help us any. Actually, if you want, what we can do is check here and we'll see we have seven animals. Uh, ground, 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 ground. And we have two underground with one flying. So we've got plenty of animals that we should be able to find here. And there we go. Excellent. Now, how many of those creature pellets do I have? I have a huge inventory here, so we're going to put them up here. There we go. Just make a couple extras. Needs carbon to make that, just so you know. And I have mine set to a hotkey. I think it's three. Yeah, three it is. So that gets us another one. But we want to find a whole grouping of green dots if we can. Or red dots, as the case may be. I think we got one down there. They're slowly starting to come in. Wow, look at the size of that thing. Wow. Tiny, tiny, tiny. So, just keep dropping them down. Throw some of these guys over here. Let's get one lung up in the air, see if we can get that guy to come down. Excellent. And that's pretty much what this mission's about, just feeding the animal. Not even worry about gathering up any feces or anything like that, so just, just feed them. Look at that, we're already up to nine. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Good. Looks like we're about to get a tenth over there. That's fine. Let's take a look down here. We should have some more creatures down here. Boy, that first plant planet that you land on in the uh, anomaly, uh, pardon me, in the expedition, is a great planet for this kind of stuff. Look at the size of this creature. Look at it. I mean, I don't think I've ever seen such a tiny creature before. Point 0.5 meters, my foot. Well, then again, that might be about the size of my foot now that I think about it. So, yeah, anyway. Grab him another creature pellet. We're up to 12. Let's go down a little further. We can always call on our ship. Oh, look. Jade peas. What? Get that out. Alright, let's go down to the plains down there. Let's see if we can get some more animals to show up, because we're a bit high up. Yep, landed a little too hard there. There we go. There, okay. So we're getting some more popping up over here now. Drop one for you. That should get a couple of them going over here. Some more over here. Obviously tiny ones. So this is the slow go of getting these creatures to respond. Looks like we got a couple more over there. So this is kind of a slow going. Now there might be another another planet nearby that has more. That they tend to populate better. You may want to keep an eye open on them. Excellent, excellent, excellent. Okay, I think we got some over there. Let's look over this way. And they all start following you around like crazy. Now what you can do too is scare them. Usually works okay. And it might bring them back. Well, I think I just scared the baloney out of these guys into non-existence. Let's go over here. Let's feed these two. There we go. Two more. More than halfway there, but it is a slow going.
There we go. Okay, good. Whoops, I really didn't intend to do that. That was kind of mean. Yeah, if I had another weapon on here, it might work. Maybe we should do that. Let's switch over to a different... There. There we go, that seemed to work better. So you do that, and then drop some food down, and you can get new friends. Oh, look at that, we're already at 40. Okay, so that should pull them all in. Let's pull in our ship, shall we? Cannot land here? Why not? It's just mean. <laughs> all right. And there she is. All right, so we're done with this. We just need to head back to the anomaly, and we call it done. Return to space anomaly. There you go. Okay, we're good. We're good. So yeah, I do recommend going to a different planet. Now again, if you ended up at a different planet, I'd really like to know. Because I'm curious about that. Don't try to go to hyperspace to try to find your space anomaly. Pull the space anomaly in. Okay? There we go. Good deal. Alright, again, I hope this uh, episode of the Anomaly Mission finds you doing well. If you have questions, too, by all means ask. I do have two videos coming out next Wednesday. Two videos, I hope, to come out with next Wednesday. One about settlements and one about the Dreadnought, Pirate Dreadnought, for my permadeath playthrough. So, then there we go. Complete the mission. And you get your 1800 Quicksilver. And again, there shouldn't be anything new in the Quicksilver vendor, but as usual, I will double check for you folks. Great items. Yeah, there's nothing new here. We're still on the same stuff because uh, most of the stuff that we're getting right now is from the expedition itself. So that'll work out really great. All right, so that should take care of it, folks. I'm going to go ahead and leave you here, and I hope you had a wonderful time. Please hit the like and hit that subscribe button if you want. Really appreciate it. It always helps all the analytics, and we will see you again real soon. Take care, everybody.